The operation is tonight. The spy has arranged a meeting between me and the rebel leader. I just need you to get me to the designated location. Got it. So you're ready to close the net? That doesn't concern civilians. The defense force has dispatched their elite. The rebels cannot be allowed to escape. We mustn't delay. Let's move out. And well done. What did I do? You weren't late. You smiled. Does me being on time make you that happy? Does that surprise you? Lots of things make me smile. Combat merits, promotions, the blood of traitors, extra spicy noodles, and comrades I can work with for a long time. I look forward to working with you again, Crimson Twilight. But do not betray my trust, or your punishment will be by my own hand. are here. Mm. Time for some tail care. Mm, what a bother. You wanna go touch me? You have my complete support. The rendezvous with the traitor is just ahead. Warning, unknown threat detected. Something's off, Proxy. Stay alert. Mr. Mole, Faithen has guided me to the meeting place, but your leader isn't here. And there are soldiers everywhere. What's going on? Mr. Mole, I don't know what you're talking about. Don't treat me like a fool! I know you don't intend to defect! Does the name Crimson Twilight sound familiar to you? Not really. You see, the crafty broker Shepard's intelligence network has long since been compromised. I'm not interested in personal grudges between intelligence brokers, of course. All you need to know is, this is the end for you!
We don't wage wars unprepared. I don't expect bugs scavenging in the dirt to understand matters of military integrity. What are you talking about? You're not the only ones who planned ahead. Our elite soldiers are on their way right now. Surrender your weapons while you can. Otherwise, you'll become nothing but martyrs. Trigger, current position status. What? It's not going through. Don't bother, Sergeant and Imposter! I'm sure you're familiar with signal jamming, right? This equipment belongs to the Defense Force, after all. That's right! It's the transmission device you tried bugging me with last time! You modified it to record any messages it sent, but you never expected it to have already been modded by me! Now, across the entire Hollow, only our troops can communicate! Your dear comrades in the Defense Force are like headless flies right now! But they won't be waiting long. We'll send them to their deaths right after dealing with you! You're fooling yourselves, traitors! Leave these fools to me! I'll hold them off to buy you some time. Now, fake Faithen, please go help my lost allies. Run! I'll hold them off! Calculating emergency evacuation route. You can't get away! Catch that bang boo! We're no pushovers either. Calculating emergency evacuation route. I've detected the enemy signal has disappeared. Given the client's difficult situation, I suggest you get in touch with the Defense Force as soon as possible. You needn't worry. Your all-powerful assistant has located a nearby Defense Force contact station. Get yourself there, and we can find a way out. This ejector should be useful. Extracting carrot data. Decompiling encrypted files. Soldier 11's private number found, creating a backup. No. Even if the contact station could try all the secret channels at once, there's too much static for us to hold down a signal. Suggestion. Abandon the existing Defense Force communication protocols and re-establish a new communication network. I can try to retrieve the Defense Force communications data left over from the previous two commissions and establish a temporary link. I thought that clear cache button was just for show. But this time, we really owe you one. All right, hurry up then. Military Communications Network Basic Edition uploaded. Things are tense right now. You can all thank me later. Oh, it worked. We've got a signal from outside. I see you. Who are you? Where are you? Don't worry. I work with Soldier 11. Thanks to you, communications have been restored. I am aware of your cooperation with Soldier 11. We will reorganize our offensive on our own. Please hurry back to support Soldier 11. Going back the way we came is the fastest way to get to Soldier 11. But the road is packed with rebels, and we are alone. Don't worry. I'll do my best to cover you.
You're going to join us? Are you coming now? Should I pick you up? That's not needed. As I said, I see you, and that's enough. Sniper trigger in position. Please, feel free to move out. We're counting on you to save Soldier 11. I'll cover your return from here. Soldier 11 fought here. This is worrying. We should hurry. You cannot pass! <sighs> the road is closed. We have to press both controllers at the same time. Give me a hand. They broke through the lock so quickly? Target locked. Ah, reinforcements! Hold them off! You won't get your way. Leave this area to me. Go and help her. You should understand. Your little tricks are futile when faced with professional military teamwork. Uh, but fix the network for them. Uh, that fake All oh, right. You don't get it. Because you're nothing but a despicable traitor.
Now's our chance. Let's pursue. Traders, 12 o'clock. <laughs> the imposter is catching up! Why is this so difficult? I can't believe there's anyone in the world as incredible as Faith and... Yeah, I don't know what to believe anymore. Thanks for your support, I guess. All right, brothers! You're up! Remember, put true justice! Charge! Now, to preserve our energy, the main force will flee first! Huh? Yes, sir. Don't worry. We'll take care of it. Don't let them through! The rest of you, there's no escape. Your weapons are your life. You should be well aware that prisoners of war are taken good care of. Just give me the whereabouts of Mr. Mole, and I'll make sure you get the treatment you deserve. If... if that's what she says, Warren Officer, they're real tough. We don't stand much chance with so little firepower. Warrant Officer is my old title. Under our banner of justice, we are all equal as comrades in arms. We shall not cease in exposing war crimes! We shall not cease our march! True justice is on our side! Charge! <sighs> really? We're really gonna charge? <sighs> That's all we can do! Taking up arms gives us a chance, but casting them aside leads only to a dead end. How? Well, how do you mean? Let me be straight with you. That first girl, the one called Soldier Eleven, I've heard of her before. I don't know when it started, but she really hates traitors. Rumors say if she comes across anyone who betrays the Defense Force, well, they never leave the interrogation room alive. You mean she off them? That, that, that can't be true, right? Her people make the paperwork airtight, of course. In any case, I don't want her catching me. Those hands, they've long been stained by the blood of her victims. That was a great attempt, but it didn't work. I see. Seems like the only way to get them to listen is by force. I 
I didn't want it to fix. The warrant officer made me do it. <laughs> Soldier 11. I've heard of you before. You'll show rebels like us no mercy. It's true. My men are clueless. I've always been the one to contact Mr. Mole. Do what you want with me. But them, please, send them to a military tribunal so they can at least get a fair trial. I think there's a misunderstanding. I'm a soldier, not a brute. Everyone, including you, is going to get court-martialed. You aren't going to hit me? I don't know what you've heard. As I recall, you've just confessed to being closely associated with Mr. Mole. Tell me where he went, and you all will have plenty of room to negotiate your sentences. The prisoners were stubborn, but they finally gave up the Mole's escape route. All those things he heard about you, are they true? Um, if it's okay to ask. You mean, about me disposing of rebels? Soldiers follow their superiors' orders. That includes orders not known to the public. In fact, the only thing shared publicly is the summer menu for the canteen. I did what I must as a soldier. My loyal service doesn't require me to be a perfect and flawless individual. Do we have to keep discussing this? All that's left to do now is to chase down the mole. Lead the way, Proxy. Get ready! The showdown is near! Traitors are mine to punish!
good I am. Of course I deliver. By the way, Soldier 11 left a message saying they evacuated. Probably to take in the prisoners. So, we're the only ones here right now. <laughs> Who, who's talking? It's not the same voice as fake faith in... Your scheme almost worked out, but you were wrong about two things. First, you underestimated the soldier. Second, the truth is, we are the real Faithen. <gasps> Fairy is showing the size of the hollow rapidly getting smaller. We did what we came here for. Let's get out of here. <laughs> Wait a minute! <laughs> Help me! Lord Faithen, let me be your dog! <laughs> No matter how many times we find ourselves in these situations, I always end up feeling kind of sorry for them. Sorry, we went ahead earlier. Some of the prisoners can't stay in the hollow for long. What about your teammates? I thought we'd get to see them. I sent them back first. If we get the chance, Crimson Twilight, I hope to formally introduce all of you. I was impressed with your acting and your quick response, not to mention your skill as a proxy. The truth is, I'm the real Bathan. For real. This show's over. You acted the part well. I'm sure you'll be just as famous as Faithen one day. Well, I should be heading back. Perhaps I'll stop for some noodles along the way. I heard there's a super spicy noodle place nearby that's worth checking out. If that's so, then you should see me around here more often, Crimson Chili. Why are you... Please, call me Faithen. Hmm. Fake it till you make it, right? I think I get it. Goodbye, Faithen. I hope we can both have some good noodles tonight.